Hey, listen, we just had, make sure I'm recording. Listen, I just, I just came out of a youth service here and in the chapel where they have church. Yeah, they had maybe about 200, 300 young people in there. And when I showed up, they were dancing and um, there's a minister by the name of Kevon. And man, he was really, really, the Lord used him in ministering to them and have the call and response. They had a little chant, the thing that they do, clapping of their hands. And so I was to share a few songs and to give a word. <laughs> And I had a different kind of a lesson, but when all that energy was in the room, the children were already hyped. Yes. 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 I'm about to perform in here for the youth. This is going to be nice. And these are some of the young, young, young children and all for, for the cause of Christ. So, changed everything for what we did. Um, I shared some of our rap. <laughs> and let me tell you about a man from Galilee. Um, that's, that's old in the US, but it's brand new here in Africa. And listen, we shared some of that, and then I segue it into a, worship, a few worship songs that sang. One thing I love about the youth here, they, they have beautiful voices, and they pick up real fast. You share a song, you sing one stanza, before you know it, they already have it. Before you even get to the second stanza, they already picked up what you were doing in the first. And I love that, you know, if, you know a good choir director loves when people can pick it up, <laughs> pick up what you're trying to do. So we were, uh, we had a marvelous time with that. What I shared with them after we did our calisthenics, you see I'm so sweaty, it doesn't take much for me. But um, on the stage, you know, we, I asked for some actors and I shared this story out of uh, Second Chronicles chapter 20. And I had one of the youth represent Jehoshaphat. And I had a group of, uh, by t-shirts, by colors in the room to represent the different tribes that were uh, trying to attack Judah. And Mount Seir and Moab. And, and when we, um, that's a very powerful story. And the, the whole purpose, you all know, if it be not but one, passage of uh, scripture in that story in the 20th chapter um, is that the battle is not yours but it is the Lord's and one of the things we learn is that our praise is our weapon it's the truth anyhow our praise is our weapon and so all that the enemy tries to do to attack you know we don't we don't go at it the way the world does and this is what I was sharing with the the young people, I told them, you know, the different tribes that we had uh, on a stage to give each other mean faces. Mean faces, so Mount Seir and Moab, would they, the kids were looking mean at Judah. And I had one young lady who could sing, she had a beautiful voice. She represented the singers. And Jehoshaphat, God led Jehoshaphat to have the singers sing. And as they began to sing, the other group, I gave them instruction. Listen, they were acting. And so <laughs> I told them to now turn their mean faces to each other. And then they fell to the stage. And everyone laughed and we just clapped. Let her sing. And watch what happened. Y'all ready? Here we go. Let's 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 go.
I will be visiting a church service and asked to give a few words, a few comments about some of the things that the Lord is having me do with Momentum Christian Ministries. So uh, listen, this was, this is tattoo on steroids. And I thank God for it. Thank God. See, we, we value the gifts that God has given us. I've heard this said once and many, many times before that your gift is not for you. It is for somebody else. Listen, God bless you. And you'll see more videos coming soon. Walk with the King and be a blessing. Song. 112, 112 verse 6. Our closing song is comes from the song number 317, page 114. By peace. Yes, I've been.